Welcome to Napkey, the commercial software that makes your mockups come alive. Okay, the software that you see here is not Napkey. This is Balsamic Mockups, the low fidelity wireframing tool. I already have a mockup XML on my clipboard, so I'm going to import it in the application. There you go, a simple registration form, and I'm saving it to my desktop. Done. Now it's the turn of Napkey. It's an Air application, so it's available on Mac, Linux, and Windows. With Napkey, you can create projects intended as a collection of mockups and you can export them to Web or Flex 3 code. Let's start our first project changing the name and importing the mockup we just created. With the tabs, you can explore the various sources and have a preview of the final result. Since the export uses CSS, you can easily modify the appearance of the components. Let's work now with the two applications side by side. I'm not quite happy with the sign in link and I want to replace it with a button. I just delete the link, add a new button, double click to change the label to sign in. Okay, let's save the mockup. And boom, I have the preview that's automatically refreshed in AppKit. Adding interactivity to the export and mockups means adding just a few lines of code to the final result. Those were pretty simple components, but what about more advanced ones? Let's try with an accordion. For mockups, I just add the accordion, double click to change its default tabs to something more meaningful, well, kind of. I also want to display the second tab by default, so I change the selection property for the component properties window. Let's save again, and there you go, a beautiful jQuery accordion in our web page with a second tab opened by default. And now the JavaScript source tab has also some code in it. I hope you liked this preview on Napkey. If you want, you can subscribe to the mailing list, follow Napkey on Twitter, or write me an email.